Two days ago, I saw a news article in Economic Times that the Nama Metro Yellow Line in Bengaluru is set to commence operations on January 6th. This new line is meant to connect RV Road to Bomarsandra, covering key areas like Electronic City, a hub for prominent tech companies. Tejasvi Surya, Lok Sabha MP from Bengaluru South, confirmed the updates on social media. He announced, we now have the first train ready to be dispatched to Bengaluru on January 6th. Titagad has committed to deliver the second train by the end of January or first week of February and the third in April. Thereafter, they will deliver one train per month and increase to two trains per month by September. As per the post on X by Mr. Tejasvi Surya, Titagad Wagons Limited will be shipping out the train sets on January 6th. That doesn't mean the yellow line operations will start as claimed in economic times. But it is good to see the young politician from South Bengaluru constituency is trying his best to expedite the delivery of coaches with whatever control he has on such matters. As I read through his post on X, there were various types of comments like someone suggesting him to review the Microsoft project plan, some other user talking about standardizing the locomotive design so that the interoperability is easier, others getting annoyed on the delay of commencement of operation of yellow line etc. It is important to remember that the train sets to be used in yellow line is different from used in green and purple line. The yellow line train sets are fully automatic, so the signaling system is different in yellow line compared to green and purple line. Hence, yellow line operations cannot be started with train sets from other line. Moreover, already green and purple line are overwhelmed with the passengers and are struggling without the new coaches due to be received from CRRC manufactured by Titagard Wagons Limited. The Bengaluru Metro Rail Corporation Limited has faced criticism for failing to meet multiple deadlines for the yellow line launch. Titagard Rail, which primarily manufactures aluminium coaches, is producing stainless steel coaches for the first time. The process is time consuming as Titagard personnel, many of whom are new to the metro car manufacturing, must meet CRRC quality standards. Tasks such as welding, gluing and crimping are being supervised by CRRC engineers. MP Tejasvi Surya revealed that he has been closely coordinating with the train manufacturer Titagard Rail Systems over past few months to expedite the production process. Several challenges, including securing visas for engineers, have been resolved. Originally, CRRC had won the tender for supplying the train sets to BMRCL for Yellow Line. But due to constraints of supply chain challenges, compliance with the Make in India initiative, 75% local production requirements, COVID-19 disruptions, FDI norms, and trade restrictions with China contributed to the delays. Subsequently, CRRC collaborated with the Titagard Wagons Limited to manufacture the coaches for Yellow Line based on the specifications of CRRC. Now, Titagard has dedicated production line for BMRCL trains so that the deliveries can be expedited. So, my best guess is the start date for the Yellow Line is March 2025. Please let me know in the comment section what is your opinion on the launch date of Yellow Line. And for more such updates, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thanks a lot.